Coliseum here at Bristol Motor Speedway. I'm Alex Hayden, and today we're gonna see cup cars race on dirt for the first time in 50 years. This place challenges you every second, so there's no place to hide, and I know we're gonna witness something extra special today. getting ready to see the drivers push their cars to the limit as they slip and slide around on that beautiful red Tennessee clay. And we're about to get ready for the first of the race for time in 51 years that cup cars have raced on dirt. And as always, Alex Hayden for giving us the pre-race and the engines have been fired. And here we are. Oh yeah, we're gonna witness something special here as the inaugural NASCAR Bristol Dirt Race is underway for 37 laps. No one car already up in that wall, that's the 41 car of Dylan Walker. He's gonna send it in under Austin Dillon out of turns three and four. Guess who's gonna be leading the first lap of this race? Joey Logano leads the first lap. Logano really good in his heat race. Won his heat race last night and really just been good all <laughs> just all weekend long. Keep in mind the first stage is 11 laps long. Logano leads it. Well, the rookie from Iowa who has little to none dirt experience this is now trying to crack the top 10. He's going to crack 11. Oh, it's Busher and the wall he goes. Now coming up on the two of Brad Kozlowski. Yeah, you know, he's one heck of a race car driver. You know, I just been watching him throughout his career on board with him right now. Just been one heck of a race car driver. Really respectable race car driver running up the hill. Running Kyle Busch up the hill there. <laughs> I don't know if Kyle Busch even liked that, you know? Keep him in line. Logano trying to become the first repeat winner this year after we have six different winners on the 2021 season. Logano trying to be the first of those repeat winners of the season. Yeah, I'm going to be shocked if Logano did get a <laughs> win here. I mean, Hamlin, there he is. Yeah, I don't think he's won at all this year, so... Yeah, he hasn't, but Logano won at the Daytona Road Course. And that wild race that we had there, that race is crazy. A lot of wrecks, a lot of tempers, a lot of penalties, but Logano won that race, and he is trying to win at Bristol Dirt. Battle for sixth place, Alex Bowman and Dylan Walker. Walker's gonna get around Bowman in the 48 car. And out of turns three and four, yes he is, he's gonna pass him. Lugano still leads this race. A contact made with Lugano there, or the five of Kyle Larson. I wonder if he five, surprised if Kyle Larson somehow pulled pull it off today. Won the Daytona 500 earlier on this year. Looking third place. That's Mark Truck Shooter, the winner of the truck race last night. Put on one heck of a performance. Went on and won it. Yeah, Bristol in the trucks. Walker has cracked the top five. You got the Elliott in fourth place there. Logano trying to win the stage. Walker's going to get under Elliott. Oh, and he puts Elliott in the wall. And around goes the 41 on the final lap of stage one. 
He saves it. We're good. Still green. Man, but he's going to lose his fifth place position from the five of Kyle Larson. Logano still leaves it. He's battling with Bowman. Now turn stream four. Logano to win the first stage. Logano wins the first stage of the Bristol Dirt Race. That's going to be the first caution of the day. Shocker. Honestly, it's shocking there, but there's a top ten. Not really many surprise, surprises there. Walker went around there after the stage break. Here we go for the second stage. This stage is 11 laps as well. Lap 11 now, lap 13, 12. Lap 12. Right now from Bristol. As Logano gets the big lead here, here comes Hamlin. On Logano. Walker's gonna get the bumper to Logano. He gets Logano loose. Side by side. Side by side there after giving Logano the bumper there. Logano goes to the inside. Walker goes up the hill. Oh, he's in the wall. Oh, he goes crossover move now. Crossover for Logano. Walker clear set away. Set sail on the way, I don't know. But Logano right there, he's won here. Logano's won the night race twice, you never a spring race. And Walker, who is a rookie, trying to become a first, the first winner on dirt since Richard Petty. Back, I believe, at Cream, at um, the North Carolina State Fairgrounds back in 1970. Yeah, and it was not a Ford that day. I think it was like, I think it was like a Mercury or something. Well, let's go on board with Walker's helmet cam. This is what he can see outside of his car, very dirty. Um, windshield there, and he has a second lead over Joey Logano. Here's out his back to window, or back camera. Keep in mind, we're talking about a kid who has no dirt racing experience, this 25 year old out of DeWitt, Iowa. You know, he's just been really strong in his career so far. Not really the strongest he's been in the last few weeks, but here he is, race. Um, just dominating this race. He's a really good short track driver, and he said this track really just drives like a short track because it is a short track most of the times. And look at those hands there. And when he used the bumper to get up to Logano, and when he put Chase Elliott in the wall and went around, and really he used the bumper a lot in his short tracking days when he used to race in the na in late models. He always used dirt uh, bumper. He said. And he really just didn't regret that. He didn't even do that to his own teammates out there in the Xfinity and now the Craftsman Truck Series, but you know, Camden World Truck Series, move that still back. And you can see there on his digital dash, there are a lap nine of 11 in stage two. He's trying to get his first career stage win, hasn't won a stage yet, but here he is about to do it for Stuart Haas Racing. Coming up on Kaz Grala and Joey Gase and Chase Briscoe, now Briscoe, Started around where Walker started. That's a, by the way, that's obviously Walker's teammate. Everybody's gonna get under the gates there in the 53 car. Oh! Now turns three and four, one lap to go in stage number two. Walker trying to get his first ever stage win of his career. That's right, he has zero stage wins. But he does have a win at Las Vegas. That was a, by the way, that was a clutch victory at Las Vegas too. That I think he just lost, got that out of luck. But this, oh, and Cody Ware is around. But the caution is going to end. Dale Walker has earned his first stage win. Walker with his first stage win there after Cody Ware went around. And Christopher Bell gets the final stage point.
All right, here we go for the final stage in Bristol. Back underway. Oh, goes up, trying to block Logano, and Logano back out front. There's a pace, what's the pace car doing? The pace cars enter the track once again. Oh, and a big one. Now Truex is around, the big one's gonna happen. Man, the pace car just went back on the track there for no reason. Must not be thinking right. Now Truex is gonna slightly edge on from Logano. Oh, he gets the bumper to Logano! Logano's around! Logano goes around. Here we go. Two laps to go in the final stage in the race. Walker gets into the wall there, he keeps it on there. Here comes Hamlin in third place. <laughs> Walker's on the wall again. Talked about it, clutch victory for this driver. Oh, and he's stuck in the wall. Here he comes now, he's gonna save it. Oh, this was that, the same thing that happened last year when he got, oh man, with Chase Elliott and Logano, Logano goes around. Got the save, oh no, Logano spins him out. Logano was not happy about that. No, he was not. Caution. Walker's deep back in the field, NASCAR overtime. Walker's gonna drive it in deep. Into wall he goes. Pagano leading, Hamlin goes to the outside. Next race is Martinsville. Oh, Pagano, oh, a bunch of cars having issues here. Hamlin takes the white flag. Harvick stopped in the back. Hamlin's leading this race. Ha! Oh, are you serious? Hamlin's gonna steal this one. Everyone was confused. Oh, here comes Walker now. What is Walker gonna do now? Ham oh, everyone else is pinning. Walker's gonna take the checkered flag in Bristol. He's gonna win the Bristol dirt race in his second career victory. He becomes the first repeat winner in 2021. Wow, everyone must have been confused there. That is insane. There's Walker who dominated the day, beginning your first repeat winner. There he is in Rolf Morgan's victory lane, hitting the roof of that car. He is in victory lane for the second time in his NASCAR Cup Series career. Wow. Well, here's our standings now. He has two wins on the 2021 season, leading the playoff standings and insane there. And that'll do here. From Bristol, we'll see you guys in Martinsville.